Shalom Israel, this is Bishop Nathaniel. The Israelites have been scattered across the four corners of the earth, as prophesied in Deuteronomy, the 28th chapter. Here in Israel, united in Christ, we need your help to recover the remnant of our people. Teach them the gospel. Please help us, support us, and join or donate to the Booster Club today. Shalom. chapter 81 verse 11 uh -huh. but my people will not hearken to my voice hold on God says listen my people they don't want to hearken to my voice we like to hear everything else but God's voice we want to hear blow a bag we want to hear where the weed at we want to hear where the hoes at we want to hear everything but the voice of the most high God and that's why you got brothers bugged out on the corners like this Bucked out they mind. You see what I'm saying? This is a black man today. Read what you got. The book of Psalms, chapter 81, verse 11. 
But my people will not hearken to my voice. God said, you black, you Hispanics, and you natives, you don't want to hearken to God's voice. You don't want to hearken to God's voice. We tell our brothers, listen, if you if you are in, if you are enticing a sister, you gotta marry that sister. Stop stop jumping from sister to sister to sister. Because what does that create? It creates single parent households. I get I bet you a lot of my brothers on these corners, they grew up with just their mamas. Their daddy wasn't in their life. Bring it out! We gotta change the mindset. We gotta wanna be better for our kids, kids, kids. That's what we gotta think about, read. But my people will not hearken to my voice. In Israel, were none of me. We didn't want nothing to do with God the same way today. Read. So I gave them up unto their own hearts. Lust. So what? Read that again. So I gave them up unto their own hearts. Lust. Do you see what God said, bro? He said, listen, that's the same thing we do with our kids, right? If your kids... You telling your kids, listen, I need you to be in the house, 10 o'clock, whatever, when the street lights come on. If your kid come in and he disobeying you, after a while you're going to say, you know what, you don't want to listen to me, you stay out there and you do it your way. Let me see where that gets you, right? That's the same thing God said to us. He said, listen, y'all don't want to listen to me. Y'all don't want to do it my way. Let me see how y'all do on y'all own. That's why you got us in Egyptology. Some of us in Islam. You see that? Some of us... We just, we, uh, our Bible is rap music. That's what we love. We live by the code of the streets. That's right. Tell me what the streets have done for us. Bring it out. What has the streets done for the black man? Bring it out. You got men who have sold the most drugs ever. The, the real Rick Ross. All these OGs who have done it before, they say, you know what? If I would have known what I know now, I wouldn't have done it. That's right. Because now mentally I'm at a higher place where I see it don't get you nowhere. It gets you jail or it gets you six feet under. That's it. That's it. That's it. It don't get you nowhere else. We got a church on every corner, a liquor a liquor store. Guess what? That's set up to destroy you. What they teaching in these churches? They teaching, y'all got the image of white Caesar Bose? They're not teaching you about Jesus Christ being a black man. Oh, he right here. You see this, bro? Who was we taught this was? Who they told us this man was right here? Oh, gee. Who they told us this man was right here? They said he was Jesus, right? Is that what Jesus looked like? How do you know that much? Where can we go to find out what Jesus looked like? Huh? Let's get there. Revelation chapter 1. Bring it out. Because many of our people, they don't know that Jesus Christ looked just like them. That's right. Christ was a black man. Revelations 1 and verse 14. Let's start at verse 1 first. Because that's what we come out here to tell our people the truth according to the Bible. We're not teaching you no lies. If you got questions, come ask. That's what we're here for. The pastor don't let you ask questions. The pastor kicked you the hell out of the church if you come in there asking questions. Look, my brother over there shaking his head, yeah, because he know I'm right. The pastor kicked you out, you come in with questions. We are gods, we are kings, we march in faith, cause we believe we can Change the world to what it needs, stand against our enemies, cause we can Yeah Kings demanding change cause we believe we can.